Open is Russ. Thought about it. Now he'll take it. Oh, Reggie. <laughs> the players told the official, you get the ball down. We're tired of jumping. We want to save all of our energy for the fast break. I'll tell you what, Ed Malloy is pretty tough. Most recent draft after one season at Baylor was the sixth man of the year in the Big 12, only shooting 46% at the line so far as a rookie. In the first quarter comes out, Dacia Nix picks him up. Eric Gordon also back out there. And It's just a disaster. Oh no. Rose continues left handed. <laughs> There's a foul call. So he's going to get. Now, if that happens without a whistle, it becomes a jump ball. How often do you see that? Maybe one. Crowd getting a kick out of this left hand scoop that would not go in the hoop. It's like a puck that sits over the hole. Again, T. Jazz good looks from downtown. 9 of 29. Here's a three. And the touch of the ball. Let's see. Touch. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. That led to a three point bucket by them. And and Westbrook are starting together. A lot of people were curious about. We'll see if that's how it goes in the regular season. There's Nas Reed knocking down the three. Okay, so you got a push right there. <laughs> Ow, <what> the <laughs> but yeah, the push initially from McDaniel. Westbrook able to get inside again. Peyton didn't think he was going to go left. But Triano said that, that he can get into those mismatches. With bigger guys. And the crowd here at the Chase Center. Starting to celebrate as Steve Kerr calls a timeout. And a technical foul. Somebody punched the ball into the Grant stand. Williams and he got thrown out. Scott Foster giving him an explanation. A rough night for the Celtics. Well, it has been just a magnificent start to the season. Hey, the calls go to the aggressors. Well, first so of let's all, say Minnesota had Belly's their best player to eje ejected. Be Belly just pulled his shorts down right in the middle of the, the crowd <laughs> right here. You don't, you don't see that very Whoa. often. Whoa. Okay, we're going to be seeing that <laughs> on replays for years to come. Who was the Managing the three-point lead. Draymond again down the deck to lay it up and out, but he'll draw the fouls. Porzingis was beaten again. I think Draymond thought it went in. I think he thinks it went in. With six seconds left, got to get it in. Here's LeBron. LeBron throws his shoe for the win. Lakers are going to lose at point four. Or at least it appears that way. Corner, high percentage. It was right back to LaMelo. Nice job sticking with it. <laughs> and Ja just wants a blow here. It's been a lot of running back and forth. I've never seen And you this. can do this. The ball hasn't been touched. He theoretically could do this until midnight tonight. We've seen a lot of basketball. I don't think I've seen this. He wanted a rest. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Terry just got say that referees on the money sometimes and sometimes they're not across the board let's be able to tell the story three of his last four and now another well, you wonder if it's starting to get in his head at all as he's missed four of his last five and those are big misses when you're trying to climb back into the game and how about what he did after that is a quality quality shot and possession by the Cavaliers these more so. yeah those points in the paint now 16 8 whoa, whoa Tucker oh my goodness I thought he walked didn't he walk? knee and he threw it up and in Good deal of their points and their scoring in the paint. 
Five to shoot. Pat Bev attacks, put it up and in. Count it. Patrick Beverly. Paul trying to just take the ball. Gets nothing but skin and send him to the line for an end. Two-minute mark of our fourth quarter. Hornets are going to get to the 500 mark. He's got some affection from Dwight Howard. And he knew it was coming. Look at here. Yeah, it's coming. I know. Yeah, you got that one right. Lob there for Alex Lynn. Jimmy Butler has to deal with him, and that's going to be an offensive foul on the seven-footer Lynn. And Butler taking a sex exception. And T.J. McConnell literally dragging him away from the scene. Good hard foul from Lynn. Jimmy in his stroke removed, still there. Oh boy. Oh my. Wow. Perky jerky from the foul yeah. line. And you know the free throw line is the one time where everything's slow and you really got to think about your shot. He clearly looks uncomfortable there. Cavs are poised to win their fourth straight game and sweep this four-game homestand. Crowd here inside Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse and a lot to cheer about as. Well, I'm not sure if they thought that he called the timeout or whether he put the ball down. They called it out of bounds. And I understand what I was watching the whole thing. Not to let those guys get in the game. The official said he put it out of bounds. So they four called the turnover. Seven Utah here at Little Caesars Arena. Gabe Cunningham will drive it. Tries to hand it off again inside to Isaiah Stewart. Pass got away. The white side pass picked off by Hamadou. Hamadou rises. Watch Hamadou Diallo. I'm going to get back on defense, but no, I'm not going to get back on defense. I'm going to step into this passing lane.